Well, this afternoon, Fitchburg police are searching for suspects following a deadly night of violence. Two shootings in close proximity rattling a Fitchburg neighborhood. And police say one person was killed in that violence. WBZ's Anna Myler has the latest on the investigation now at noon. The police chief says his officers were up all night investigating two shootings here in Fitchburg, one of them fatal. And here behind me, you can see a Subaru from the second crime scene. It has bullet holes and shattered windows. Blossom Street remained blocked off with crime tape this morning. The Worcester County DA, Fitchburg Police Chief and Mayor all at the scene where a person was shot around 9 o'clock last night. As a result of that shooting, there was one fatality. Then, about 25 minutes later, police rushed to Goddard Street, about a mile away, for reports of a second shooting. I was laying in bed and I heard like four sounds. I thought... I literally thought it was fireworks. But it was actually the sound of gunfire. Police say a person was shot, but their injury is minor. A Subaru was also hit with bullets, and investigators could be seen searching inside and taking photos. This mom says now that she knows those loud sounds were shots, she's nervous. It makes me not want to live here, to be honest. That freaks me out a lot, um, especially he's only five years old, and I think, oh, what if we were outside? The DA has released little information about the person killed on Blossom Street, but says they were known to police. The chief is now asking the public for help and also making this promise. We are working and diligently hard. We're, we're not leaving any stone unturned on this matter. And I assure the people of the city um, we will work until we have some resolve. Police are now trying to figure out whether the two shootings are connected. No arrests have been made. Reporting in Fitchburg, Anna Myler, WBZ News.